The Arkansas Razorbacks are undefeated to start the 2020 season and a good start to this series as well. They can clinch the series today as they welcome back the Gonzaga Bulldogs to Bob Walker Stadium. There's the man, Patrick Wicklander. You got to see him last week. How'd he look in his opening start? The numbers were good. Yeah, he was really solid, you know, really had good control. The velocity was off just a little bit, but it was freezing cold, so you might see that edge back up. You look at the stats. It's Robert Moore charging up. It's a pretty good play by a first-year player. Well, you still know, love how Patrick Wicklander has really gone after these hitters. And there he got the punch out right there. Wicklander makes quick work of Gonzaga in the top of the first. And the like Opitz gets moved up in the order, and this is why. Extras for Franklin. Cruising into second. Two out double. And the first base runner of the day for Arkansas. Ooh, Jacob thought he had it. Early, got on campus in January for Arkansas, and here he is. This lofted into center will fall in, and the Razorbacks are on the board. Good piece of hitting by Robert Moore. Just cued that one out on the end of the bat. Bristian. Didn't have a chance on that one. It was kind of the same thing in basketball, but baseball's that funny sport and really good pitch and battle back by Patrick Wicklander. Got the K looking right there. Been tough in that middle of the order. Wicklander gets him here though. And it's another one, two, three inning, second of the ball game. With the shift on, and Marinko able to slide in and make the catch mile-an-hour change. Got him. Rando thinks that ball's in, and he's not happy with home plate umpire Jason Black. Each line, and it sure makes a difference. Grounded a short Martin on the move. Little bit high, but Austin able to come back down on the bag for out number two. Got him. Another strikeout for Wicklander. Two in the inning, five for the ball game, and his third one, two, three inning. Scrappy hitter, a guy that has tough to strike out. There he is. Takes a hard turn and a look at second, but it was cut off well. Boy, really good job by Wicklander right there. You see him really hold the ball for a long time. Not only does this is there goes the runner. Opitz throws on the money to second. And he's caught his first runner stealing in this series. And he'll make him think twice next time. Well, you talk about the accuracy of Casey open corner. And then he throws an absolute dart down to second base. Approach is very businesslike. Hard hit ball into center and falls in ahead. And Bristian, boy, he dodged a bullet there as he was laying out. He was somehow able to get it with one hop. Shows bunt. Lays it down, and it's a good one. That'll work. A little small ball by Arkansas. Back up the middle. What a diving stop on it by Yake. And gets past first. In to score is Robert Moore. Razorbacks double their lead. game home run slump. What does that say about your abilities if that's what people start to expect of you? Opposite field he goes and it'll drive in another. Boy, that's why he's a next level hitter right there, Josh. That is a guy that most guys will pull off and maybe ground that ball to second base if you roll over the top. Heston Kirst that allows that ball to travel deep in the strike zone and just says, you're going to give that to me, I'll take out it. On a, a weather day like this compared to what tomorrow might be in Wicklander makes the play. That's retiring Ernie Yake. It's been pretty easy out there for Wicklander. He hasn't really struggled. Witness another exhibit. Strikeout for Wicklander, number seven for the ball game. Arkansas up 3 0. Looked really good. He said, yeah. You know, he showed up the very first day. He was there late, of course, because of the World Series. As this sneaks past Marinko and Franklin's aboard. But he said, we watched him take BP and thought. Clyde. Skied up, drifting back to left, back to the track, looking up, it's gone! Robert Moore goes deep for the Razorbacks, and the freshman 
first career home run. Wow, he is psyched up. You can see the left fielder Sullivan thinks I thought I had it. And then congratulations, and you can see how everybody's thrilled for Robert Moore. He is completely jacked up from the wind. Off the bat, you think that's not. He even kind of threw his bat down, thinking, "Man, I missed it." And then you see Sullivan just continue to drift back, and he's like, "Man, oh man, I can't believe that carried out." Look at the reaction right there by Robert Moore. That is one happy youngster. Won't soon forget that moment, will he? Hard hit ball. Yake scoops it up. Gives it a shot at first, but never really seemed to have a chance. Nesbitt runs pretty well. Alex threw me off, Josh. That's what it was. <laughs> From one Alec to the next, this ball will fall into the gap. Advantage of running with two outs. Nesbitt able to get all the way to third base. Hayden Monk, another left-hander. Monk, Josh, when you see him come to the plate, if you're a hitter, all you see is knees and elbows. I mean, the guy, he has a tall drink of water. I think the 100 it's a good battle back and a good recovery after the leadoff walk. There he got him, Monk. Martin, routine play and very calm. Cole Austin, even though coming off the bag, able to get the tag on that. Wind in the center, there he is. Knew it'd be sooner or later. Taken off, having a throw from the knees, and going for third. Martin is in safe. And a consistency, Kevin Copps is a guy that can provide it for you, and he makes his second appearance of this series. Run in Omaha, a pretty good looking pitch right there. Copps thought he had a piece of play, but. Quick turn to second. There's those quick hands you were telling me about that Robert Moore's got. Boy, what a feed right there. He just can pivot, throws a strike to Casey Martin, and Martin with a really strong arm. Watch how fast Robert Moore gets rid of this ball, and that makes that throw really easy for Casey Martin. He gets him by a full step at first base. This could be trouble. What a flip with the glove. Are you serious, Robert Moore? That was absolutely sick. Oh my goodness, the fans here in fam are gonna love this kid. The glove flip, and it's, it's even a backhand glove flip. What a play by Robert Moore. Arkansas is gonna bring in Elijah Trest. Maybe one of the guys that could potentially be a closer for Arkansas, and they might even go by closer by committee. Opposite field, base hit for Ernie Yate. Well, held him quiet today, including a couple of strikeouts. Charging in from third, Nesbitt, nice play. Well, he made it look easy with his smoothness, but for Arkansas, which was his longest outing of the year, scoreless baseball. This ball hit well, but dies off in front of the track. Two down. Fastball up in the zone. Got him swinging. Opitz picks it up. And on the money to first to complete the strikeout and end the ball game. A 5-0 win for Arkansas. And they move to a 3-0 series lead here over Gonzaga.